former University of Texas quarterback Vince Young was fired from his alma mater, and we're going to point and laugh at it, and all that's coming up after the bumper. What do you mean oh. you don't subscribe to my son's YouTube channel? Mama, no! Just snap the damn ball, RJ. What's up, kid folk? It's RJ Young. I am not on a step milk. Did it in the like and subscribe button, because I upload a video every single day. It's always OU related, college football related, sports related, we have a good time. And today, we're going to point and laugh at Vince Young getting fired as a development officer, which is a part-time gig, at the University of Texas. Now, Vince Young was arrested in February for a drunk driving incident. Then on March 1, which is a Friday, he got fired. Which leads me to make the joke, how the hell are you going to get fired on your day off? Some of y'all know that reference, some of y'all don't. But here's the reason for why he was fired via the Associated Press. Young's March 1 firing letter says he was dismissed for not demonstrating significant and sustained improvement in the performance of his job responsibilities and failing to maintain standards of conduct suitable and acceptable to the university. And he got warnings as far back as 2017. Now, for those of you that are living under that particular rock, Vince Young was the best football player in America in 2005. Famously took University of Texas to a NAS championship where they beat Reggie Bush and Pete Carroll in the Rose Bowl. Now, Vince Young should have been an outstanding NFL quarterback. Also, kind of went MIA. Now, where this gets interesting for me is that I remember seeing Vince Young on the sidelines at Texas games. I remember that everybody was excited about Vince Young being involved in Texas football. Problem with this is Vince Young apparently does not care to come to work. And, you know, the Bernie Mac joke there is, I ain't coming here to work. He came here to collect a check. He came here to be Vince Young. On that front, I ain't mad at him because you're Vince Young and that's Texas. You should not have to buy a meal, buy a drink, pay a parking ticket. Not only were you the best that they had, you brought them a national championship and were one of the real guys that was able to convince Mac Brown that, no, you don't play defense back. You play quarterback. And yes, Vince Young was pretty doggone awesome as Longhorn. But over here, over here, this is just funny. This is funny because, of course, Vince Young didn't come here to work. It's funny because, of course, Vince Young was never going to take that part-time job seriously. And for you to fire him over what we think is the drunk driving incident, all right, cool. People get fired for less every single day, right? But you knew what a time it was. You knew that Vince Young was never going to come to work. And the fact that he never came to work since 2017 just should not surprise anybody. But... On the other hand, do you know how excited I would be to keep getting warning letters for two plus years that I'm going to get fired if I don't improve my performance and then I still have the gall to not improve my performance that I don't care enough about this job at all? Like I could really give two of those deuces in this hand rather than come to your job and work. Like I feel like this is exactly what University of Texas knew was going to happen. Except maybe they thought that Vince Young was interested in working. Although I can't imagine why they would think that the only dude to win the national championship in this millennia is interested in working. I think he should be able to collect a check for, for just being, I'm, I'm playing. I don't think he should be able to collect a check for winning a national championship. Although, there's a lot of folks in the state of Texas that probably would sign off on that. That's how much it meant to them that Vince Young led them to this and put that rose between his teeth. But, that you can get fired on March 1 on a part-time job and be Vince Young is just laughing, laughing, laughing to me. And I'm sure I got more jokes on this and we're going to make more jokes on this as we get closer to the season. But you should know that this is funny. And if you're a Texas fan in the comments, fight me. Deuces.